Hi, I am at Facebook. At Facebook, um, we were told about a school. It seems like it's a high school. Oxen, O-X-O-N, high school. Oxen Hill High School, rather, in Maryland. The students are using their freedom of speech through art to convey the murders by police. And they have here a black image with his hands up, don't shoot. And it's an American flag turned upside down, which means distress. And the young man uh, has been shot uh, 10 times and there's blood dripping down. And the blood makes the stripes in the flag. I think it's a very well thought out piece of art and the students should be commended for it. Right here, we have a police officer who has a starkly white face, stark white, and a blue uniform with his badge. And on his front here, it seems to be uh, notes written and maybe pictures of people who've been killed by police officers. And it's surrounded with a tape. You know, I can't see the words on the tape. Let's see if we can see it a little better. If we go to box. Okay, so. This, do you see the art they did? And the principal made them take, the principal took their artwork down, okay? It was taken down, apparently uh, in violation of their free speech. That's a very obvious violation of their free speech. If they're allowed to do an art project and center it in the school lobby, it should not be taken down because cops don't like it. Okay, so that's what's happening. And they have a petition to uh, not censor them. They're looking for public support for their art to be displayed. It's at change.org, and it says, uh, petitioning Prince George's County Public Schools. The students of Oxford Hill High School have a right to freedom of expression. Now, I looked up Oxen Hill High School at change.org looking for their petition before I got this link. And I wasn't able to, Google wasn't able to pull up a petition looking up change.org and the words Oxen Hill High School. I think that also is censorship. Change.org censors people's petitions. I want y'all to know that. But anyway, uh, we're right here. The reason we're filming today is because I want you to know that uh, I did find the petition. And when I found the petition, I put it here. And some of my friends have been liking it. Now, this friend, whose name is Susan, not made out of plastic, Garcia, she had another comment right here. It's gone now. She commented to let me know that she wasn't able to like the petition that I found here. She was not permitted to like it. And, uh, and she wrote a comment to let me know it should be on this line. I wrote her back a response. And I said, please send me a statement that you're not able to comment at Facebook on the fact that these children are being censored. You're not able to comment at my post supporting the children of this high school. In Maryland, you're not able to support their free speech by commenting 
on my page. Because when I sue the United States of America for its censorship, uh, I'm including all of the violations against my First Amendment rights in that lawsuit. As a human rights activist, I am terribly censored and not letting me read comments that people write to me and not letting them receive or read my messages back to them. All of those are free speech violations. There are violations against our freedom of expression and they're going in the lawsuit because I've asked American justice system to uh, trace the source of interference and stop it and they refuse. In fact, uh, they probably are the ones doing it because the USA uh, had, was a participant in the secret arrest, that's a kidnapping, and murder of my brother Larry Neal, and they want me to be quiet anyway. So that's wrongful death of Larry Neal. Look it up. So what we have going on now, uh, you know, as this country turns more and more fascist, more and more people are experiencing censorship. And these high school students are censored uh, because they complain against mostly white police officers killing uh, black youths like themselves. Since they threaten black youths with these police violence incidents, I think it's right and normal that the black students would complain about it. Go ahead, you can have it. You can have it. I was trying to make peanut butter crackers. Okay, go on downstairs. The crackers are downstairs. Okay. That was my granddaughter. But anyway, naturally young people know that police are killing them in astronomical numbers. They know it's a point of alarm for most people, most thinking people. And they're concerned about it, whether they're black or white. They've been killing white young people too. Remember that they killed a young man, uh, Cameron Reedus, who was going to be, as I understand it, uh, uh, the top of his class. He was graduating from a college in Texas, and a police officer killed him for talking back. He was unarmed. So they're killing blacks and whites, but mostly blacks, because they go for whoever is the most powerless. And these young children, these uh, high school children are letting them know that they know about their murders and they protest their murders. And I think that that's reasonable. And this is their protest. And it was taken down. They made, they took it down because evidently police complained to their principal. And they are asking us on this petition to have the right to freedom of expression. Now, I've had a petition to have the right to freedom of expression for some time. That's free Mary Neal. Uh, it's at I petitions. And sometimes when you go to I petitions uh, or go to one of my blogs, for instance, free, F-R-E-E, speak, S-P-E-A-K blog, you'll see instead of the petition, you'll see a note saying that I petitions is offline. So that's, that's because even this petition is censored. And as I said, I'm filming today because a friend commented at the petition. At first we couldn't find it, but when we did, we put it here. She tried to like it and Facebook would not let her like it. I wrote her back, and I did not put it as a reply to her post. I put it in a separate block. Because when you reply to a post, then if the post is taken down, your reply would be too. I don't like to uh, leave what I write to anyone else to take down. So I started a new comments block, and I told her to please send me uh, her complaint about them taking down my uh, uh, her statement about them not letting her like it. And 